Hello and welcome viewers and subscribers of AVG News. Only say the son of Nube is my name. And as I say, that will be give you updates from what is happening in Zambia, where Zimbabwean opposition supporters are planning to hold a, a protest against President Emerson Nangakwa taking over as the, as the Sadki chair uh, and Zimbabwe assuming the Sadki chairpersonship because of the political impasse that they say is at Zimbabwe, in Zimbabwe and the alleged human rights abuses against members of the opposition and uh, leaders of the opposition. Uh, what we are gathering now are fears that one of the Zimbabwean journalists that are covering the protest that is passed on Gambakwe could have been arrested because the last time he was seen, he was addressing, uh, he was reporting live from uh, that particular place uh, on Facebook and the last one that was seen was Zambian soldiers or, or police, it's not clear, uh, accosting for him and ordering him to stop recording and then they were pushing him away. So we don't know as yet what has actually happened with him, but we await feedback from him uh, if he is indeed safe, but we've sent him some messages which he is yet to respond to thank you very much you include here a video of him addressing from the venue or from close to the venue and we leave it to you to just uh, watch and make up and make your mind as to whatever could have happened how bad the situation is you've got a situation where a president has rigged an election a regional board has issued a report that says the rigged election 17 out of 20 criteria not met and I've received accreditation to go in there. And someone at a very high level of the Zambian government has made the decision, Kuti, if we just allow this information that is going to come out of here to be broadcast, it's going to be amazingly difficult for the Zambian government. That's how afraid the Zambian government is of Mnangaba. Mnangaba's tentacles are spreading across the whole country. In fact, going to other countries. That is how bad this situation is uh, with Mnangaba. So let's watch and see but all i can say is that we are entering uncharted territory as africans and as zimbabweans it is going to come down in history but there was a man called Mnangaba, and what he caused in in africa is terrible yeah let's look at the job <laughs> job is saying but it looks like we are alone <laughs> I'm, I'm doing my journalism work i'm not here to protest i told you one good in the dream cut i was inside so the guys who are protesting are going to be there. They are there. They are. We even paid for some people who didn't show up, though. Um, we paid for some people to come, and they didn't show up. Uh, it's very unfortunate, but there are people here who, who wanted to protest. I don't know if they've been stopped somewhere, but you can see that security has been increased dramatically. They have put 16 soldiers just on this stretch. So if I'm looking down, there's even more uh, soldiers. So these are armed people, but I don't think those people are a threat because when i was with the police the armed police inside they were very cautious to me they talked to me nicely there was just one crazy person uh i don't know if that is the guy from zimbabwe <laughs> who was trying to make himself look important uh and the funny thing is once we're in zambia here it's no longer like zimbabwe where you can just find someone and shoot them you know, like you find someone and then you start shooting and, and the police are coming now so guys just Make sure that I don't get arrested, okay? <laughs> Hello, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, you want me to? I was talking to you. Can you stop, 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 okay, okay. stop it now? Okay, okay. Okay. Now. I've stopped. Let's go. I've stopped. Carry your things. No, carry your things. We have told, we have advised you. Don't want